Remember the JM4 holsters that had a magnet? Now, there's no magnet. Hey guys, it's Kelly here from Armed and Feminine. And uh, like most manufacturers, um, we're always looking to improve their products and respond to customer um, suggestions. So here's a new JM4. Um, this one is called the Relic. And um, what's really neat about this one here, the other JM4s were made of leather, uh, mostly because they were in the South and Kydex, you know, molds or changes shape under certain extreme heats. This new one here, and this one is for the Glock 19, um, is made of a different material. It's a PVC and alloy mix, um, or acrylic alloy mix, I should say. It's called Bolteron, B-O-L-T-A-R-O-N. And what makes this product different from Kydex is that it's far more resistant um, to extreme temperatures. So for all my girlfriends who live up in Alaska and for all of you down in South Texas, there's going to be less chance of your holster um, warping or cracking or changing shape due to your extreme temperatures. The other thing that's really cool about this is they've taken that Bolteron and let me put my gun down and hand sewn, well, maybe it's machine sewn, but it's sewn, it's not glued like some other ones. Real awesome Herman Oak leather and uh, Herman Oak leathers, great US company. They've been around since 1881. Um, and what that does, listen, or I should say, you won't be able to hear it. That lovely Kydex sound that we hear when we holster and unholster, click, click, click there is no more sound. So this is sort of like the unaudible holster. Um, it's really, oh, it's, it's a super nice product here. Um, and we've got a thin clip. Now what you will note is that um, the clips that, that come to it, we had to uh, cut this one off, it's a little longer. So you can adjust this up or down and put some Loctite on it wherever you like. Um, and it'll fit an inch and a half holster. But listen, you don't hear that click click. So we have that lovely leather sewn, hand sewn, right on to this new Bolteron product. So um, this is kind of funny if you can see on my jeans. Clearly I need to get new jeans. I've had these forever. I've got the holster mark. Dear God. Uh, but it's really nice and it's comfortable. It has a nice little sweat shield on here. And, you know, certainly I would say maybe even a little more comfortable than wearing Kydex. Not quite as comfortable as the leather, but we know that the leather can shift over time as well. Um, so I just got this. It's a little new, so I need to stretch it just a tad, but there's no click. So if this is something that interests you, the new Relic holster from JM4, some awesome Bolteron. Like I said, it's a alloy product. Not going to change with the extreme temperatures. So if you live in the deep south or somewhere where it's really hot or way up in the extreme colds, this might be a great option for you. I'm Kelly from Armed and Feminine. Hit the subscribe button over here. Or if you'd like to see another video, click there. Remember, it's your life. Protect it. If someone's going to like bitch at me for holstering right into my hand.